In this tip of the week, we will look at peer review assignments. Peer review assignments are non-graded activities that enable students to provide feedback on another student's assignment submission. The peer reviewer is required to comment on the submission details page and, if a rubric is included, to enter recommended scores and feedback on the rubric used to grade the assignment. To create a peer review assignment in your course, go to the Assignments tab and click the Add Assignment button. Type in the assignment information, such as the title, descriptions, and amount of points the assignment is worth. Submission type should be set to online. Peer reviews only work with online submissions. In this example, we'll make it a file upload. Check the Require Peer Review box and you will be given two options to either manually or automatically assign peer reviews. For this example, we will assign them manually. Add your due date information and click Save. If you would like to include a rubric for assignment grading, you can add one now. Be aware that the peer reviewers will be given the same rubric you will be using to grade the assignment. They will be required to complete the rubric with a recommendation for each assignment they are assigned to review. Once you have set up your assignment details and chosen whether you want to add your grading rubric or not, click on the Peer Reviews link. Here, you will see the list of students with the option free to manually assign students to one or more student submissions that they will review. You can do this before the assignment is due or after the assignment is due. To add one or more submissions to a student for peer review, click on the plus button next to Give Username Another Submission to Access. Then select a student name from the drop-down menu. As mentioned before, the peer review process is not graded in this activity. Only the assignment that is being peer reviewed is graded. If you want to assign points for completing the peer review activity, you will need to create a separate no submission assignment in the gradebook to manually assign points. When the student logs into My Classes, their to-do list will tell them peer review for assignment name. If the student goes to that assignment, they will be prompted to submit their assignment as usual. They will not have access to their assigned peer reviews until they have done so. In the assignment submission area, they will see their list of assigned peer reviews to complete. If they have not been assigned a peer to review yet, they will receive a message that reads, None Assigned. The warning icon will remain next to each student name that they have been assigned to peer review until they have completed the review activity requirements. Once they have submitted a comment and submitted their rubric recommendations, a green checkmark will appear next to the student name to indicate that the peer review has been successfully completed. If you create a peer review assignment and then you select the Automatically Assign Peer Reviews option, you must set a due date and select how many reviews you would like each student to complete. The system will automatically assign out peer reviewers immediately after the set due date and time has expired. Any student that failed to submit the assignment by the due date will be ignored when the system assigns out peer submissions for review. After peer reviewers are automatically assigned, you can manually add peer reviewers to students that submit their assignment after the due date. Thank you for watching this tip of the week. For more information, please refer to the following guides.